Donnie Dwyer of the Sports Cycle here with Jared Fay, sharpshooter. Yeah. You know, my thing is, you know, you got a ball in your hand. How much have you been working on your shot lately? Um, probably like hour a day, normally hour, hour 15 minutes a day. Try again every day and be consistent with it. Um, yeah. And the thing is, your brother's going to come here next yeah. year. So I was going to say, what is it going to be like playing college ball and your brother here, you know, helping him at Ford and mentoring him? What is it going to be like him being here it'll next be year? It'll be fun. It'll be fun. Like, it'll be good, too, because I'll, I'll, I'll always be on him to, to, to be in the gym and to improve his game, too. So I'll be um, uh, excited to have him up here and have him with me during the, the four years. We see. And the big thing is you hit that three against UConn, yeah. you know, your first college bucket. Uh, what did it feel like hitting that three, and what did it feel, you know, finally getting out here on the big stage? It was fun. It, it felt good, man. All the hard work pays off. But I want more than, more than just one, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm going to keep working, so I, I, um, I get my way in the rotation in the future and just keep pushing myself. And you got a great relationship with Ryan Canty. Talk about you guys, you know. You know, you got, you got Jay Faye and you got Rizzy this. What yeah. is it like? Well, see, we, we uh, met in prep school last year, and, and we just kind of clicked, man. And now we're, like, best friends. So the past two and a half years, we're always together on and off the court. So it's fun, uh, fun kid, too, to, to be with, an innocent kid. And what is it like in practice? You know, you, you, you don't get all the playing time, but you in yeah. practice is huge because you can hit the three ball, help yeah. them out on spreading the defense and whatnot. How, how, what is it like being that instrumental guy on, in practice? I just always, always try to push, you know, playing, playing against like Brian Smith and Mandel and Fraze and Jeff, I like, I like always try to D them up, make them have to defend me and, and make, make them play honest defense. And just always try to, try to work out, I'll work them in practice to, to make them a, a better player, you know what I mean? So that's what in practice I do and just make shots. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely, and uh, the A-10 season starts uh, tomorrow yeah. and whatnot. You know, you're the first one. Something goes good, you're the first one jumping out from the bench. Yeah. You know, what are you, you going to tell your team? How are you going to motivate, you know, Ryan and the guys, you know, tomorrow? Just, just play hard, play tough. And in the A-10, it's, it's a tough league, but anyone can, can beat anyone on a given night. Like last year, we, we, we had Xavier here. But like an eight-point game, so really anyone can, can be anyone. And these, these these first two games are big for us at home. Duquesne and UMass. I feel like if 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 we can start it out two and zero, it will boost our confidence and just keep keep rolling. You know what I mean, just keep keep getting these wins and make the um, eighth tournament this year, hopefully. And uh, what have you learned? You know, second year here. What have you learned about Fordham, about basketball, and about life? Um, well, it's it's a um, great school, great great um, education, and really basketball wise. At, at the uh, at the uh, college level, it's playing hard every possession. You know, it's in high school you can kind of kind of like be the star player, so you kind of like take a playoff. But in, in college, it's every play it's it's, it's uh, so demanding, but it's it's a, a great feeling to, um, to to be a part of it and to hopefully turn turn form around and get back in the 810 power. So it's, it's exciting. <laughs> and this guy is going to try to you know power everyone to win tomorrow against Duquesne. Thanks, Jared. Well, and remember, for all your Fordham Rams news, updates, and scores, go to thesportscycle.com.